back there, Tower Rubin, uh, and of course the great Jim Brown. Uh, you know, it's a pleasure having these guys out there, uh, especially with Jim Brown presence, man. It's, it's, it's an honor. You know, it, it makes me work that much harder you know, for him to just be out there. What was he saying to you uh, when you were talking to Jim over there on the sidelines? Oh man, I, you know, I asked him, you know, was he happy to be back here? He like, man, I, I, I couldn't wait. And, you know, about that, you know, he was saying, I couldn't wait to get back, you know, to, to be in, in the Browns' presence and then where, where I need to be at. And, and telling me that he's going to, you know, be on me. We're going to have our one on one. We're going to have our talk to our mind. He's put together. And I said, our mind's already put together. You ain't got to worry about that. Um, you know, from, from the standpoint, he is, you know, player engagement, but at the same time, I will be getting advice from him because he is the best of all time. No question about it. How much better physically are you? Not that you weren't in shape last year, but in terms of what camp you get, how much further along are you this year than you were last year? Uh, way better. No surgeries before the season. Um, I ain't planning on having none this year. So, I mean, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's on the uprise right now. Um, taking one step at a time, like I said earlier. Just, just loving it right now, man. You know, but it's, it's nothing like football yeah, shape. You know, we still got a long way to go. I still got to work hard if I can play all four quarters. And I'm going to be in the best shape I can be when it comes in September. Oh, Trent, do you have to hold, hold back at all so you're still fresh when that um, opening game comes in September? I don't hold back at all. I still play. I play down every down like I can get better. Every down like, you know, just get some new down. So, to me, I'm working so I can be in the game. And working as I'm in the game situation. So I don't hold back on nothing. Trent, I heard earlier that. You're really, you know, light on your feet and quick. Do you feel like that? Oh, yeah, I feel weight, but, you know, now with all that extra padding right now, uh, especially with the big thing I had around my ribs, uh, lost weight, 225. Probably came into count 230 last year. Uh, probably played at 33, not being able to you know, run fully other than Friday before the game um, due to you know, injury. I mean, so it, it's, it's a blessing, man. Um, you know, to be in the shape that I am right now. I worked hard back home with Coach Boyd, my, my head coach. I had track coach back home. I received coach back in football in high school. Uh, and we've been working all off season to get me you know, to where I'm at right now. Trent, earlier today, Jim Brown said you weren't ordinary anymore. How good does it feel? For him to finally say you're not an ordinary back. I mean, at the same time, uh, it's still a lot that I got to improve to. Um, especially with, you know, first the fans, or my teammates too, um, to the NFL world, I still haven't did what I you know, think I can do. Um, and what my mindset is set to, you know, for him to say that, you know, like I said, it's, you know, it's big, you know, hear from him. But at the same time, I'm not going to let my head get big. But at the same time, I still, I still got a lot to prove myself. Especially to my, my Brown fans, to my people back at home, to everybody. I didn't hear you earlier. 